Hey guys, I'm Leon and welcome back to uh, a room build. So uh, since like today I made up to date, I made only like one room build. So um, no, I was thinking about, you know, it'd be better if I make another room build because I only had one since like Sims 4 came out. So here we are, here we are building another one. Uh, since I can't really record Let's Play because my computer is dying, it's literally dropping frames right now when I'm recording this voiceover. So, uh, yeah, pretty much. Uh, I'm just waiting for it to catch on fire, literally. I'm gonna stop. Anyway, uh, so this is the cool kitchen. Um, this was uh, specifically designed uh, to work with uh, or to be part of cool kitchen stuff pack that just came out like nine days ago so nine ten days ago actually it's 21st not 20th anyway um so yeah i really love it it's a it's a dining room slash kitchen it, it does have a like a one square table with four chairs so um yeah i really like it i did uh, uh i did include the ice cream machine um to be honest uh I do have the Cool Kitchen stuff pack, obviously, uh, but I never uh, uh, tried the ice cream machine yet. I don't know why. Don't yell at me, but I know I should have, but I just didn't. So, yeah, then I uh, see here I was having problems with Windows. I was trying to put these, but then I noticed, oh, yeah, there's no, like, singular, like, one tile of version of these. And... Um, uh, we can't stack uh, windows on one tile because other ones will not pretty much be windows anymore. So, uh, yeah, you'll notice that this uh, you will notice that this is in the uh, a little bit different format. Uh, uh, you, it's a sped up video, uh, just because um, I for room builds uh, it's pretty much like thirty minutes long, and um, uh, I don't know, it's just weird to. Um, like, watch me think for like 30 minutes if like, will this chair fit in this corner or not? Okay, let's put that on this chair. Will this table fit in that corner or not? For like 30 minutes. So, uh, like, just on and on. So, uh, yeah, so I'm doing this. It's like 10 minutes long. So if you watched my very first speed build, um, that was in Sims 3 on this channel. Uh, it was like around, I think, 10 minutes or so long. Uh, because uh, that was my initial plan of how I wanted to have uh, speed builds, like around 10 minutes. Because then want to make them long, just for people who like uh, long videos, speed builds will be short, let's plays will be long. That was my uh, thing. Let me go to uh, Sims 3 speed builds. Here we go. Let's see. Uh, 11 minutes and 36 seconds. So, yeah, but I that didn't happen because... Um, uh, the way I recorded it, so it took a lot. It, it takes a lot longer to do it in that fashion than like just record your screen how you do it. Uh, as I am right now, I don't know where I'm going with this, but I am somewhere. So yeah. Uh, anyway, uh, I really hope you guys enjoy like these uh, nine minute builds. Um, trying to keep it short, simple, and not like too long or too short. So uh. Yeah, so I think I'll make a lot of room builds right now be just because I can't record Let's Plays anymore because <laughs> my computer wants to freak out when I hit record and then I go into like live mode and it's just... It... Frames are horrible, people. Frames are horrible. If you haven't already checked out my uh, fifth episode of Teen Runaway Challenge, <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. Uh, if you have, not if you haven't, so. Uh, yeah, also, just checking out... Uh... Cool Kitchen has three downloads right now, so maybe we can get it up to five, maybe. You can click the download button, you know, it's it's good. Maybe favorite. Uh, so you can, uh, there'll be a link to it in the description down below, or you can just search the hashtag Leon Benkavec or hashtag Cool Kitchen. So these are the two hashtags that I included in the description. So also it only costs 18,000. So uh, yeah, which surprisingly, it didn't really take me too long to make this room or kitchen. It usually takes me around like 30 minutes, uh, not in the normal build, because uh, when I'm doing like a room build, I only have to focus on like one area, on like one room, so I have more time like to furnish it and think about it, how I want it to look like. Uh, while if I make like entire house, uh, such as a Greendale, that was really love weeks ago, I think, uh, where I had to like, pretty much in any house, I had to like, you no. Know, 
I have more room, so I don't really have time to make uh to think about like thirty minutes about one room because there's like five hundred of them. So, um, yeah. So here I want to put a big like family dining table, but then I realized uh, later, uh, uh, I wanted to put a bar, but I couldn't just fit it in. So I put a smaller table. So this table goes away. Um, and as you can see, if you don't already know me, I like to swap like colors uh, from chairs to have like two colors and then like uh, there we go, like swap them. So it, I I think it looks nice. So uh, yeah, then I was having problems with these new lights uh, that come with Cool Kitchen. They look nice. They light up everything. Uh, everything but the wall, uh, so uh, the walls were really dark, everything else was perfectly lit up but the walls, these were these things were like dark and dark, so uh, you will see me later putting some, uh, I think these are the only uh, items that I put from get to work, uh, the, um, the uh, wall lights uh, that come with it, because uh, they were kind of hidden, um, so I wanted to uh, uh, add like a <laughs> I don't know how to explain this. I wanted to add like a glow on the wall to the wall uh, So it looked like there's like light shining off of it I thought that would be like a cool effect just like you see there with these uh, luxury party stuff lights um, uh, So just like a little glow of light like a different color so uh, You'll see me there go messing around with this. I was planning on putting this red plumb up But it's in the way you can see it. So as you can see now I'm experimenting with it and then at the end I put the get to work uh, lights. Uh, the orange ones you can see, um, they're, th uh, um, uh, yeah, I, I think, uh, yeah, these. So typing the ultra long cheat, bb. Uh, ignore gameplay unlocks entitlement. This is so unnecessarily long, then I lost it, I don't know where it, where it went. So you can see I put it uh, uh, all the way to the top. You can't really see it when you are, like hide the walls, so it, it really, as you can see, now I'm just changing the lights, as you can see, adding like, a, I added, I was planning on making it uh, red, but then I noticed I only have um, yellow and green color theme in this kitchen. Uh, so that's what I normally do, like three colors the most to like, basically. Uh, so obviously excluding uh, white and black, because these are like, you no, know, like, let's say highlight colors and, you know. Those stuff. So uh, I went with green and uh, yellow. They uh, came together quite well. So uh, I added like this. See this. This is what I'm talking about. This green glow and uh, I also added the exposed brick. If you haven't already seen that, um, I thought that looked really nice. That's just that little, little level of detail to the to the um, a wall or to the kitchen. However, however you want. Then I added all around the room because everything was really, really dark. So yeah, uh, I think I uh, hidden one of. Uh, I think I, I think I did. Uh, I hide one of the lights um, uh, be at the behind uh, of the cabinet. Um, and you'll see me placing this down later. I think. Uh, then I noticed this room is uh, one square too, uh, not wide enough. So. Yeah, uh, for to fit like two square doors. So yeah, instead I put one square doors. Anyway, this, these are the screenshots. Thank you very much for watching. The gallery, gal gallery, like, the gallery link will be available in the description. Uh, these are little screenshots. Um, and yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Thank you very much for watching. Um, I will see you guys next time and happy simming.